I really wanted to be a, an engineer. Always, I always liked making things, all that sort of stuff when I was younger. But unfortunately, I wasn't that good at maths. So I went back to uni to do this industrial design degree, which is more of a understanding um, people and how they interact with products as well as some, a lot of stuff on production as well. So it's a really broad course. It covers all sorts of things. So I generate 3D layouts of machinery or equipment to try and help in the food processing industry. Food, the customers could be a single farmer working out of a shed, all the way up to the biggest um, food processors in, in the country. The machine at Aspel's is a, an apple intake system, and it's the machine that takes the apples from the lorries and feeds them into a cider press, that actually presses the juice out. In a, what our machine does is it unloads the lorries, and uh, then it goes through an inspection area, up a number of conveyors into the actual tanks that feed the press. Uh, Aspel's one of my yeah, biggest projects I've done personally. It's a really difficult project because of where it is in, in Suffolk as a stately home and the, you want a disc machine crammed in between a moat and a thatched building. So from a blank sheet of paper we went and measured and developed a concept. The concept was then sold and the machine was built and then fitted uh, only a week ago. When you see crop or you see it actually doing the job it was designed to do. That's when you kind of get the uh, job satisfaction. So what I really enjoy is every day is completely different. You could be dealing with one problem one day and the next day you're doing a completely different job. But it's always a challenge sort of thing. It's always difficult and you've always got to try and overcome something.